What's going on guys and welcome to a sports card collection video. Today we are going to be going into the 15,000 card collection that I just recently acquired. As you can see, I pretty much have gotten through all of it. All that's left is these six boxes. And uh, right over there is stacks upon stacks of Hall of Famers, star players, star rookies that I have found in the collection that I will eventually go through and highlight and show and showcase here on the channel to show you what I have found. But I wanted to start this video off by giving a little backstory of what I do. About two years ago when it started to become hard to find sports cards in shops and when it became a little bit too expensive to be able to afford them, I went to go look for an alternative way to enjoy the hobby. So I started to hunt for sports card collections, whether that be online, uh, asking or asking around sports card shops um, just any way I can try to find out if anybody had cards that they were trying to sell collections that they were trying to sell and I would find them and I would grab them and it turned out that I was finding better cards and more fun cards in the collections that I was buying than if I were to buy a pack or a box in a store after a little while of doing that I decided to make a channel so that I could inspire others who are looking to enjoy the hobby and collect sports cards who are not able to find stuff in stores or just can't afford it so here we are um, i'm very grateful for anybody who has subscribed to the channel and uh let's continue the journey so in previous videos i've had people tell me that they want me to showcase some of the non-sports cards that i find and i don't typically find a lot of non-sports cards sometimes i found you know two or three here and there mixed into people's collections but in this collection i found a ton so right over here are some gi joe cards it is my first time coming across gi joe so i thought it was pretty cool to showcase i don't know too much about gi joe cards right over here we have some marvel I got some on the floor here too. Some Marvel cards. Gideon, Magus, Thanos, Gideon, Mad Thinker, Sauron, Apocalypse. There's just a couple Wolverine and Hawk. And in here, there's probably the years 1990 to 1993, kind of various years mixed throughout now right over here we have some fortnite cards these are newer cards uh just a huge stack of four i don't i don't know anything about these um but there's a ton of fortnite cards here as you can see nice stack of fortnite cards right over here we have some wwf classic cards i'm a huge fan of wwf so i know about these very cool to find those i'll probably keep those Right here in the front, uh, this set is called Valiant. Um, there was quite a few different versions, I guess different sets within Valiant. I don't know too much about it. I'll probably have to look it up. But um, I thought these were pretty cool. Kind of look like superhero stuff. Then if you move over here, we have some Death Watch 2000 made by Classic. Also looks like superhero cards. But a uh, little more grungy, a little more like adult-like superhero cards. Then right over here, we have Ultraverse cards. They have Ultraverse and Ultraverse 2. And it looks like superheroes, different versions of superheroes, different versions of, of superhero teams. But uh, there are some, some non-sports cards that i have found in this collection and now let's cut into some of the sports cards i found all right here we go here are some of the bigger sports cards that i have found so far i have a ton of stars star rookies hall of famers star players that i still have to go through sort through 
and uh, once I do I'll be able to showcase those as well but here's a start Here's a nice Cordell Stewart Topps Finest, still with the film on it. A nice Randy Moss Sensations Topps Finest. Here's another Randy Moss Topps Finest. Here is a Curtis Martin. Nice that these all have the film on. Here's a Mo Vaughn, the Rookies. Very nice condition. Don't find that one too often. Here's a couple of Mike Mussina rookies. There's two, three, and four. Here is a Sammy Sosa Topps Chrome from Topps 2000. I thought this card was cool. A Trent Dilfer. Pinnacle Artist Proof. Very cool graphics on this card. Some Deion Sanders when he played for the Yankees. There's two, three, and four. There's a nice Cal Ripken in great condition. Here's a Tony Gwynn card that I don't come across too often, but it's really cool. Him with the sunglasses on there. Really nice card. Great condition as well. So Reggie Jackson, 82 Dunruns. Tops Pete Rose. Always love Pete Rose cards. Here's an Eric Dickerson. Jackie Slater here's pretty great stuff always cool to find these Marvel metal universe there's Eddie Kennison with spider-man in the back here is a really awesome Jerry Rice tops deep threats and we found some patch cards some relic cards here is Emmanuel Sanders Pittsburgh Steelers Crown Royale nice patch underneath there we have a quadruple patch we have Clowney Foster Savage and Hopkins all from the Texans and that's numbered to 99 37 of 99 museum collection look at that that is a really nice card too bad <laughs> Savage ended up not being that great. The other three were not too bad, but uh, Savage was not that great. But very nice, number to 99. And last but definitely not least, I had to showcase this one last. It might not be the most popular card out of everything that I found, but for me, growing up, Barry Sanders was the man. I wasn't a Lions fan, but I was a Barry Sanders fan. He is the, he is still the man, one of the greatest of all time. Look at this tops fire, Barry Sanders with the Lions in the back. Just absolutely insane graphics on this card. I will probably send this one in to get graded. I don't know too much about the the cost of this card or or what it's worth graded, but for for my own personal collection. I'm probably going to end up sending this one in. This absolutely bomb card. 2015 Tops Fire. I know there's a bunch of different versions of this card. Different players. And there's been a lot of Tops Fire in this collection. So hopefully I find some more of these. Because these are absolutely fire. So there you go guys. There is a little bit of an update of what I have found. In this 15,000 card collection so far, it has been pretty bomb with the Shaq auto the other day. Uh, the Shaq rookie that was already graded. Plus all this, plus everything else that I have already found that I still have to kind of sort through. So I'm able to show you guys, sleeve it up. So, uh, so thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Smash that like button. It really helps out the videos so that new people can 
uh, f you know, find out about the videos and find out about the channel, make sure you leave a comment below. I, re I respond to every single comment. So, uh, so yeah, thank you guys once again, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care.